Every year between May and June, enteral virus infections reach their peak. This extremely contagious virus puts fear in the hearts of parents with children aged 5 and below, a high-risk group of complications. On Tuesday, a subsidiary of vaccine manufacturing giant, Adimmune, provided some good news. Its new EV71 vaccine with a 99.21% effectiveness rate will hit the market in 2025. Ad Immune subsidiary N Immune held a press conference on Tuesday to announce the unblinded results of its phase three clinical trials for a vaccine against enterovirus 71. Around the world, we've done clinical trials in many countries and many different medical centers. Now, the main topic for today is about the unblinded results of our clinical trial. So the effectiveness reached 99.21%, making it extremely effective. As for the protection it provides, it's more effective than all the products that are currently for sale on the market. Enterovirus is a contagious virus that often infects children. Infections peak in May or June every year, and the virus spreads by fecal-oral transmission and airborne transmission. Most people who are infected have symptoms like a mild fever or mouth ulcers. EV71 is considered the most dangerous enterovirus, as it has a high mortality rate. In the past, the most effective vaccine on the market was Metagen's, with an effectiveness of 96.8%. We'll still be taking our vaccine to many countries that'll need it, which includes countries in Southeast Asia, China, and countries in Northeast Asia, an area that's currently in the middle of an enterovirus epidemic period. As for the quantity for Taiwan, starting from right now, we'll have a smaller amount available. But next year, we'll substantially increase the numbers. Enimmune currently has about 50,000 doses of the EV71 vaccine. But by next year, it'll mass produce the vaccine so that over 100,000 doses will be available. Anticipating that in 2026, it'll receive medical approval from Vietnam. The subsidiary pharma company has its sights set on the newborn market in countries throughout Southeast Asia.